Good morning, everyone. It is day 11 of our 10,000 step challenge. And today I wanted to show you, before I got my day going, I wanted to show you um, my weight loss tracker that I have made in my um, book here. Uh, this idea came from a friend on Facebook. Her name's Rachel. Um, she had made something similar and posted it. Now, mine's not all pretty and decorated and stuff, but I do have my rough sketch done, so I wanted to show it to you, and I get to go ahead and fill in some of my bubbles because I have lost some weight since making it, um, but not a ton, So, but that's okay. We're going to use this to get down to my goal, which you will see what my goal weight is here in just a few minutes. Um, so anyways, yeah, I'm going to show it to you. All right, remember this is a work in progress. All I have is the pencil outline of what I want to do. I'm going to decorate these pages over time. Um, it says my weight loss log. And the first page is weight lost. Um, so starting out at 160 uh, all the way down to my goal weight, which is 120. So it'll be about 40 pounds there that I'm wanting to lose. Um, which is very attainable and I know I can do it, but anyway, so that's the first page that I have so I can mark them off, um, as I go. Sorry, the lighting's not great and if this was pinned like it should be, then, uh, it would be easier to see, but that's okay. It says, remember why stay strong. Um, I have trouble obviously with discouragement last, uh, this week I've had a little bit of that going on. Um... So then I have, this is my weekly weigh-in, um, which I need to put my weight for this week. And then I'll be able to mark off some stuff. Um, just another blank page, just in case I need to add stuff. Um, this is pounds lost. So as I lose a pound, I can mark off. And then, of course, I'm going all the way down to 40 pounds lost. And then I have this earn it spot. And so if I lose 20 pounds, I get a date night with my husband. 25 pounds, um, I get a girl's night. <laughs> my husband says, what does that look like? Uh, and I said, getting to go out with the girls. <laughs> um, 30 pounds lost is mommy's day off. And my husband said, well, what's a mommy's day off look like? And I said, that's a day where it's just me. Everybody caters to my needs and I get to do whatever I want. So I don't have to cook or clean or do anything. Uh, 35 pounds lost, new clothes, 40 pounds lost, because I'm going to need new clothes at that point, <laughs> 40 pounds lost is a weekend trip with my husband. Um, so yeah, I think that was the last night. Oh, nope, one more. Um, so I've been drinking a lot of water lately, and so I did a page that tells benefits of water, of drinking water, um, and just uh, my goal is 12 cups of water every day, which I have been keeping up with, so um, I need to go get my water for today right now so like I said that's just a rough kind of sketch at this point but um, I do get to go ahead and check off some pounds which is very exciting um, and then I'm gonna go get my water and read my Bible and drink some coffee this morning I worked on outlining and coloring in what I have already lost um, Rested it on this page here. So five pounds down from my 40 pound weight loss goal. All right, I just finished uh, reading in my Bible, drinking my cup of coffee, um, and I am sitting at 367 steps, and it's almost 11 o'clock. I have hardly any steps. So I am going to pace the house. It's so cold outside. Um, it's supposed to be in the single digits today. So yeah, it's going to be chilly. So I'm going to work on pacing here in the house. Try to get some steps in. Um, Michael comes home for lunch here in about mm, 10 minutes or so. So I think what I'll do is I will pace until he gets home. And uh, then I'll stop and take a break and uh, eat lunch with him and all that good stuff. So that's what I'm gonna do. Just pace the house. <laughs> I am filling my second jug of water for today. 
I'm excited about that. And I'm also sitting at 3,819 steps. So basically, I am just going to pace um, a little bit more. I had lunch and I finished off that other uh, jug of water. And so I'm just going to pace and I'm going to just watch some YouTube while I'm pacing to kind of pass the time a little bit more. Um, so yeah, it's, it's kind of boring just pacing back and forth and back and forth. But to be honest, it's one of the only ways I'm going to get my steps in for the day. Um, it's just so cold outside that, I mean, I could go out there and walk, but why torture myself? <laughs> uh, so I will torture myself in another way, I guess, by, uh, the monotony of pacing back and forth. So anyways, I'm going to just keep on pacing the house. <laughs> so I decided to take a break from walking. It is 1241 and I'm at 5,808 steps. I've got me another cup of coffee. Um, and I thought I would talk about what I was listening to while I was walking. Um, it is the YouTube channel Genesis Apologetics, I believe. I will try to throw up a screenshot of uh, their page so you can see it. Uh, basically, it's like taking myths and different things and showing you how the Bible is supported through science. Anyways, it's really interesting if you want to take a look at it. I was going to say gander, and I was like, people are going to make fun of me. But um, if you want to take a look at it, uh, I very much encourage it. I enjoyed listening to their their videos. My son, my youngest son, is really into um, archaeology and dinosaurs and that kind of thing. And it talks about that and how it's related to the Bible. Um, and it talks about evolution and all kinds of different things. But anyways, they explain everything so well and they have like really good graphics and stuff. Uh, and it's very interesting for adults and kids alike. So yeah, that's what I've been listening to as I've been pacing back and forth. And I just decided I was going to take a break and drink my coffee. So I'm just going to sit here and enjoy this. Curtis is almost done with his homeschool. Elizabeth is at her babysitting job and Gage has been done with school for a while now. So <laughs> just kind of a, a slow paced day around here. So this video can't be very exciting because I just keep on getting uh, on and saying that I am pacing the house. Again, I am pacing the house. I have been listening to a podcast. Um, uh, I can't remember the name of it, but basically it's talking about uh, your brain and uh, learning how to retain information. Like when you're reading and when you're like listening to a podcast or what have you. And so I'm about halfway through that. It's like a 40 minute long podcast. And I've been, so I've been like booking it for a while. Um, I'm at 8,000, a little over 8,000 steps. Uh, I plan on just continuing to, um, you know, pace back and forth for the rest of this podcast. So who knows? I might be able to get my 10,000 steps just listening to this one podcast. But um, it's very interesting what I'm listening to. Um, I'll try to maybe um, do a screenshot of the video and put it right here that I'm listening to. So far, it's good. Like I said, I've only listened to about half of it. The guy's very interesting and is making some sense and uh, talking about how to take notes and um, different things. So anyways, it's pretty good. I'm just going to continue pacing back and forth. I mean, I wish I wish it could be more exciting, but that that's, that's what the monotony is of pacing back and forth in the house. So hopefully we have some nice days next week where I can, um, you know, actually be outside and <laughs> be a little bit more interesting for you guys. There it is, 10,000 steps for today. Really early too, Let's see, it is 1.43 guys. So I'm not completely finished with the podcast though I was listening to, but I went ahead and I kept on pacing as I was listening. It's a very interesting podcast. So anyways, uh, it got me to my 10,000 steps. So I, I wasn't just sitting down aimlessly listening to the podcast or to the YouTube video, whatever you want to call it. Um, I wasn't just sitting aimlessly, which is what I normally would do. And instead I was pacing the house and walking and it actually made the time fly by um, as I was listening to what I was listening to. 
So anyways, I'm pretty happy. Um, I do need to run to the store to get some groceries. Um, so I'm gonna get more steps than 10,000, obviously. Um, yesterday I got 11,000 some odd, so I was pretty happy about that. I don't typically get more over, uh, very much over 10,000 because usually after I get to 10,000, I kind of just start taking it easy. So um, hopefully today I can get back up into the 11,000 range. My husband's like, crazy good he like got like 16,000 or something the other day and he was so happy and I was happy for him but I was like I cannot get that many so anyways um I'm kind of rambling I hope you guys liked this video if you did don't forget to give me a thumbs up don't forget to come back tomorrow because I'm doing daily vlogs don't forget to subscribe so we can reach 500 subscribers by hopefully March 12th and I will see you again tomorrow